Hello guys, welcome to today's tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to add roots to your trunks, to your trees in the new version of the tree. Yet. As you can see, there is no tab, no section for roots. So you guys always keep asking me in the older video how, uh, how to have roots in the new version. So yeah, I'm going, uh, I mean, the new version has tons of new features, which is very cool. And uh, it's a bit tricky to have trunks, so that's why you guys always can't figure out how to have them. So I'm going to just add a simple texture from their own, just to make it a bit better because it's kind of weird when the whole trunk is just white. So I'm going to straight into the tutorial of uh, how to uh, to show you guys how to do it. So. What we need to do is to have branches. Well, obviously, you're going to have some branches. So, yeah. I'm going to add a bit of uh, crankiness just to make it feel a bit natural. So, yeah. Now, what you, what you guys want to do is go to the tree tab. Go to the edit joins. And here you are. You can uh, select uh, any branches that you want. And... Position them all the way down to here. You can uh, put, uh, change, the, uh, change the pitch on your right here to make it a bit better, a bit be more natural. You can even click on these yellow points to have more options just to control those sections, which is very cool. That's why I love this software. You can uh, scale it down or scale it up if you want to. Just like uh, just like we did with this branch, we can do it with this one. Position it down to the to here. Change the pitch and yaw if you want to. So yeah, let's say that okay. So I've got branches, but what if I add branchlets? Those little branches on the branches. What about that? As you can see, you will get branchlets also on them. It can be a bit annoying as you know so you can also do the same thing for this one so for the for the branchlets you can change the pitch and your it's like the it feels more natural like the branches for the for your roots so it uh, so you can yeah as a just like uh, the way we did it with the branches you can edit them if you want let's say you don't want them how about now so if you don't want any branchlets or let's say you edited these branchlets on your branches and you want to delete the rest of them, what you're going to do is to uh, deselect the edit joints, go to the here, uh, where it was, yeah, select this option. Click on this option and here you are. You Unfortunately, you have to uh, select them one by one. You can't like... Uh, Control and select them to have a bunch of them at the same time. Oh, it deselected it. Like, say, let's say you don't want this one. You delete it. You don't want this one. You delete it. Not this one. Delete. Delete. Oh, I, I just delete the whole thing. Like this. It sometimes a bit. Oh, deselected. Tricky to select them. Yeah, let's say I want my uh, my root be something like this. It's cool. So, what if you add leaves? How about that? Let's let's just add uh, some leaves. As you can see, leaves are going to be appear on the roots as well. We don't want that. Let's let's just add a texture from them. Yes, something like that. How about that? Easy. Just the way we did it like last time. Delete them. Select, delete, select, delete. Wish, it, wish I could uh, just control and select them to select a whole bunch of them at once, then delete them. It could make it easier, but maybe they add this feature on the uh, on the future updates. So, and yeah, here you are. New version of Triad with branches. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Hope it be useful for you. Make sure to leave a like. If you have any questions, make sure to uh, comment it down below. And please, I really hope you guys uh, subscribe. 
and i'll see you guys in the next tutorial goodbye